Hey guys, Captain Wing here and welcome back to Burger Shop 2. So today we are, I think last time we, if I remember correctly, we played Relax, we played a diner challenge thing. What was um, Yeah, we played the boardwalk. The boardwalk we played and, um, well, it didn't save because we kind of exited without actually finishing the entire thing, which didn't really as we have to finish the whole thing. So anyway, today guys, we're getting back into the story mode. In the city, the big city, where we have the impatient people. So this level's called, I say, these gentlemen are important. So I'm presuming there's going to be businessmen, businesswomen, and old chaps from that? I don't know. Toasted English muffin. Toasted English muffin's really hit the spot. What? You were expecting a soliloquy? What is a soliloquy? I don't even know what one of those is! Comment down below, please. What is one of those? <laughs> so to make a toasted English muffin, uh... Put an English muffin in the toaster. Mm, duh! What did you expect? For God's sake. Can't be that stupid. <laughs> uh, and you can send stuff to the toast by flicking, which we don't generally tend to do, but you know. Yep, yeah, old chap, businessman. Oh, it's not the businesswoman. We've got the punk again, though. That's a bit of a concern, because he could be extremely nasty or extremely nice. There's two possible evils in that room there. Calm down, mate. Just, just calm down. Calm down! Just calm down and have some coffee. Really, really, really? That's not really what I wanted, is it? I am actually screwing everything up. Let's just stop. Stop, 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 stop. Stop for just two seconds and calm down. We all just need to keep our heads here. Not get over the top. Freeze! Oh. Whoa, this could be going a little better than that, uh, really. But uh, you play the card you dealt. Oh. No, not happening. I'm doing your burger bot. Sorry I didn't serve you what you wanted, but have it. Have that. Or don't, your choice, you know, really, I, it doesn't make a difference to me. Yeah, have the menu, and why did I just get that out? I have nowhere to put this. There we go, put it in your mouth. I put it in your mouth, bro. No one wants these Fruit Loops. There's so many Fruit Loops that no one wants. That's just, un that's just unfortunate. Fruity O's, that is. Fruit like Fruit Loops. Chill out, cowpoke. So, it's, well, I suppose it's going to be the uh, cowboy. <laughs> so, we've got BLT, strawberry ice cream, or six piece nugget. Ooh. I do like chicken nuggets, to be fair. So, twice the goodness, twice the nuggets, eight times the goodness. You do the math. I don't want to do the math. I just want to serve the burgers. Don't make me do that. It's <laughs> not nice. Through him. Through this. I'm just going to serve him like instant service. Like, wow, pow, here you go. That's quite useful, that's quite useful, that's quite useful. That we have got the power up that helps us do, um, not power up. Actually, yeah, the cone traffic cone power up is useful. What I was trying to say is really, really good that we. I can't remember. I honestly can't remember. I just lost my train of thought completely. I hate when that happens. Hate it with a passion! A passion fruit. <laughs> just kidding. Uh, so, the. The, the cowboy, he orders a lot of food. He gets very impatient. Well, the cowboy doesn't get very impatient, really, actually. He just orders loads and loads of food so that you can't really serve anything else at all to anybody whatsoever. I put the right things in. You are spinning. You are spinning crap at me. I put everything in that I was supposed to. Have it. We have got a lot of nuggets. A lot of nuggety goodness. I'm missing the big cowboy. Thought so, because there were two burgers left. Two! And also some ice cream and some extreme lemon lime soda, but you didn't want that. So that wasn't too bad, that's still alright. And the new rank, food item cop description copywriter. Don't really think I'm going to want a dress, I'm a male. Sorry guys, um, this level's called Don't Get Indigestion. So let's add some dessert with blueberries, because blueberries make your desserts both prettier and tastier. Of course. No indigestion, you might order a lot of desserts, but just, just try, please. For your own sake, just try. Look, you're already all going for the meat. You're all going for it. 
Just calm the hell down. Okay, at least there's no business with him if we don't know any steak around because they will order the steak every time. So if we'll order this steak. You are going to get indigestion. I'm not joking. You keep ordering those, you are going to be suffering later. It's going to hurt, and you're not going to like it, trust me. I'm correct when I say it. Really, you order those things that I don't have around? You're all being very helpful today. Here we are, let's get into it. Let's get into it. I know that they've got to serve as many customers as possible. I don't know why I lapsed into some sort of accent. An accent that I couldn't tell you what it was, because I don't personally know myself. Really? I just screwed everything up. Help! There we go. What are we doing? What are we doing? What are we saying? What are we saying? We are saying... EAT! And he is saying, okay. Man, we are done. Anyone want orange soda? Anyone wants cola? No? Fine. If you insist. Let's go. The hard city! We've got egg sandwich, oatmeal, and waffles with blueberries. Well, seeing as we are on the subject of waffles of blueberries, we should have with waffles with blueberries. Feeling blue? Well, then these blueberries are for you. Oh, you meant sad? Uh, well, these will still taste good. Yeah, I suppose so. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. We've got a lot of burgers to serve today. We've got a lot of uh, non-burgers because this isn't actually the burger time. That could be a game, couldn't it? Welcome to Burger Time! Do, 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 do. Maybe not. Maybe not. Can we, like, use this, please, these pancakes? Thank you. I really, really want to get the freeze time power up. Not freeze time, freeze patience. Freeze time? It's like an all powerful god. <laughs> we will freeze that time! The time is frozen, and it means nothing here. Actually, it just reminds me of the time warp. You know, the one that's, let's do the time warp again. And I sort of lapse into other things, because I'm getting distracted very easily today, aren't I? Right, you know when they tell you not to be greedy? Take it to heart, dude. Hold on, I'm coming. Yes, nom, nom, nom. I'll get you everything you need, and I'll get you right away. Right away. I'll get you anything that you want. Like a powder donut and a, 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 a breakfast muffin. <sighs> Sausage sandwich, that's what it is. There we go. I'll get it right eventually. <laughs> so, level 59. Yes. Lunch in the city. Oh, we got strawberry ice cream, cheesy salad, and BLT. And ads! Because we love them! We love ads! We can't get enough of them! I'm curious as to what's going on here. Don't tell me we're going to freeze up. Help me! God help me, Matt! Okay, it's done. That was weird. Okay. Uh, and of course, a cheesy salad represents a significant proportion of the food pyramid. And that's why we're having the BLT! This sandwich slows some people for a loop, because it doesn't have chicken or beef. It's actually got bacon. Ooh! And I didn't stop to look at the customers because I really couldn't be training my eyes on that kind of large list. But it appeared to me as though we had a mix of everything. Which is somewhat concerning because that's that's a lot of customers. Well, I suppose that's only a couple of each, so we might be alright. We may be alright, we'll see. Just gotta keep plodding on towards the burger heaven. The place where they send burgers when they are eaten. Mm. <laughs> Lovely. Can we serve a BLT, please, today? I'll put one there ready. You know, just so that I'm ready when the... <gasps> just so ready when the time comes. Ready for the BLT. Bacon, lettuce, tomato, and incorrect sandwich. I love BLTs. In real life, I absolutely love them. Mm. <sighs> the best thing in the world. Okay, not, not the best, but one of them. Definitely up on that list. I don't know what other things on that list include cheesecake, specifically chocolate orange to be fair, because, you know, it's chocolate orange. And then, duh, you, you can't go wrong with that. BLT! BLT! Really, a milkshake? Fine! I'll put, I'll put the chip, the fries there, just in case anyone wants to say fries. I don't want the fries! I'm holding out the onion rings! 
They won't go anywhere to anybody because there's nobody to eat them! New rank, cola steward. I go around serving cola. That's all I do. Nothing at all else. Everything else happens by the Burger Trump. Because he is the best. So let's do this level, next level. The only one I, really, I actually enjoy on this list is chicken soup. Because I don't like peas and I don't like olives. Olives are disgusting. Ooh. Chicken soup has certain special medicinal properties. Why do you put medicine in it? Incidentally, it's the same with tomato soup, steak, southern fried chicken, and pasta. And in such a case, they are considered magic food. Yes, astonishing, isn't it? How what you can find out when you watch me as I as uh, when you join me in the Burger Shore of madness. It's amazing, honestly. Whew, amazing. So let's keep going. Let's keep pushing forwards. We have enemy forces to defeat. The forces of impatience. The forces of giving the meal. Those kinds of forces. They're not very nice ones. I'll grant. I'll grant you that. But. Uh, it's the best we can do. Just gotta keep plodding on. Plodding on and on and on. What do you need? What do you need? I don't want to lose your patience. I don't want to lose your favour. I just wouldn't do. <gasps> okay, well, I get very I get very strange when I'm playing these. When I, when I do these videos, I get very strange. But then again, actually, I am quite strange in real life. So don't, don't be put off by this. Don't be put off by the strangeness I possess. Really didn't want to serve you all, but now that I have the power up, we're all set to go. We're good to go! Really? Really? Oh, I'll give you a dog a biscuit. Give a dog a bone. Or even a biscuit. It's a dog biscuit. Mmm, delicious. So, we have got the perfect service in all levels of the city stage. Expert service in all levels of the city stage. Ready! Watch this. Watch this. Your newly revealed city restaurant is another success. Oh, the ad. Do we have to? Do we have to? I can't see the ad, though. It's a bit concerning because I cannot see an ad here. Oh. All in. Well, that's obviously us. I call two. Ooh, ready, ready. There's me in the top right there. Ooh. Clearly, I've got the better cards here. Clearly, I'm going to win, guys. Oh, yes. I'm going to win. I'm going to win. Whoa, 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 whoa. I win. Yay. Your newly rebuilt city restaurant is all a success. It took a while, but you finally found the direct video for the number to Becky. How do you give her a call? Dialing. <clears throat> 001. 01 0010010010. 12 hours later. Hi, welcome to Becky's Burger Shop Mania Deluxe. Becky speaking, how can I help you? You identify yourself and congratulate Becky on your restaurant's success. Ah, Burger Master, so nice to see you. I'm in fact doing quite well. The key is that I save money on the ranch dressing. You would be surprised how much high quality ranch dressing can cost a restaurant. Not really, because I buy proper stuff! Actually, we don't have any. Sorry, never mind, take it back. Would this might come on for a while. You interrupt Becky and accuse her. Why did you make Burger Shop Burgers? I made with endangered species! Come! What is wrong with you, man? Honestly, woman, what is wrong with you? Mmm, endangered species meat. The sweet spice of extinction. You are a true delicious idea. You are truly a culinary genius, Burger Master. You sick! You are sick! How could you do that? That's just sick and twisted and wrong. Why are you eating endangered ones? But no, I did not care through your websites. I just bought your extraterrestrial restaurants from the IRS after you were thrown in jail. However, some client visited me a while ago and offered to sell you my earthbound uh, to sell me your earthbound restaurants. I was not interested. Why would I go to want to buy earth restaurants? It's a total backwater. N -n -n no offense. I feel offended. I live on Earth. <laughs> Here's this guy's address. Perhaps he has more information. You were at the address that Becky gave? It looks like an abandoned circus. You asked the man of there at Becky. He looks creepy! He's going to hurt me! Please help me! Okay, I think he's just a clown. Yeah, I tried to sell restaurants to Becky. I couldn't make any money off of them. You know, running a restaurant could be so hard. No, I've lost everything. You could sell them. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Something especially about your sadness that is especially poignant. I think I just mean like catchy or something. Like, you know, I'm gonna feel sad. 
Fine, you wouldn't want to buy the circus off of me. It'd probably make a good location. Hmm. I'm not so sure. Uh, it also goes with this key I found in your diner back when I owned it. Looked like it might be important. Since he's already clear, he decides to buy the key and the circus that comes with it. Your gut tells you that it's the right thing to do, and your gut is not often wrong. It takes a smart gut to a restaurant. My gut is good. I have an intelligent gut, guys. Ha <laughs> ha. But anyway, I think we're going to leave it there, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe for and like these videos for more Burger Shop. And I will see you guys next time. See you guys.